hate when you like go for a drink and you don't realize it's like lower than it is and so then you're like sucking in air and then you just run out of air by the time you actually reach the drink. Is that just me? <laughs> problem. No one knows I'm gay. Which you probably gathered from the title, but you know, you can't just really jump into these things. You have to kind of give like a an intro, so there you go. So in the beginning, it was kind of nice, I guess, um, being able to figure out my own sexuality before other people did because people didn't immediately, um, people still don't immediately look at me and think that I am gay. Um, so it was nice in that way that I was able to hide it, and um, if I do want to hide it, I guess the fact that I would be able to. Because I should never want to do that, right? I mean, it definitely is nice knowing that when people first meet me, um, gay isn't the first thing that they think of and isn't what they completely define me as right when they first meet me. Because I do think that um, when someone is more out there and like you can tell that they're gay, um, or even just if you hear someone's gay, um, a big thought that comes up is, okay, so they have sex with this gender. You know, that's like the big thing because that's what it is, it's your sexuality. And because being straight is the norm, I don't think straight people really have to deal with that as much because um, most people are straight, so you're not thinking like, okay, so you have sex with this gender. You know, you're not thinking sex-wise, you're just like, okay, hey, what's up, you know? But with gay people, um, since you're identifying them as that word, um, as being gay, lesbian, gay, homosexual, um, immediately you do have this connotation of like who they have sex with, which is like not even important like really to their character. So it is nice um, people first meet me and that isn't all that they define me as. And no one when they first meet me is like, she does what? In a, her own personal setting with who she cares about personally in her private life? This sounds terrible, but, you know, unfortunately, gay people, they are treated differently still. Um, although it is getting better, it's still there, you know, and I have been very fortunate, but even I've, you know, I've felt the wave of discrimination. It was so cheesy. Alright, so who are we talking about? First off, when I was coming out, a lot of my close friends didn't know that I was gay, um, so they didn't know, but mostly what I'm talking about is like acquaintances or just people like strangers that I meet not knowing if I'm gay and um it's funny because whenever I'm in like a setting like I don't know like if I'm at pride or something I'm always um for the most part I'm with like my best friend Cassie and they always seem to ask her they're like hey she she, she always comes up to me afterwards like Oh my god, why does no one know you're gay? Like, all they do is ask me. And she's like, this person asked today, this person, this person. Like, telling me everyone you like. And like, they'll be like my friends too. I'm like, guys, like, I'm gay. Like, you can ask me. Like, it's cool. <laughs> I'm not even trying to be, like, arrogant about this at all. I'm not trying to be like, oh my god, I'm so much better because no one knows. Like, I'm really not trying to say that. Like, I'm saying this is an actual issue in my life. Like, um, I mean, not really an issue, but... People just don't know, and which is not always a good thing, you know? Because at first I'm like, okay, like no one knows I'm gay, but then I'm like, wait, no one knows I'm gay. No one. Meaning girls who like girls do not know that I also like girls. Now you see my problem. So I do have all these mixed feelings um, about this whole thing, and um, still, What's the point? Why am I making this video about it and me just telling you that no one knows this fact about me? Well, let me ask you a question. What does a gay person look like? What does um, a lesbian look like? What does a gay guy look like? And if I, a real living gay person, um, am not identified as gay, first off, then what does this mean? It could mean there are a lot of stereotypes that, um, like the extremes, the, the more feminine guy and the more butch girl, um, or lesbian, those are what is seen as, you know, that's gay. Um, but then there's also the other thing of 
maybe it's not even stereotypes, maybe it's just those people are more out because it's more obvious that they are gay, that people aren't like, oh wait, there's other people on the spectrum of being gay, like there are people in the middle too, like there are people, there are feminine lesbians, there are masculine gay guys, what? I don't know. I'd be really interested to know what um, you guys think about that. I think it might be a little bit of both. Maybe it's neither. I don't know. Can people look gay? Can people look bisexual? Lesbian? Can you look straight? People seem to think so. And uh... I don't know. It's like watered down. It's not good. Making a video about being gay. That's me. Okay. And they have like a theme song. So like I'll just walk into a room and it will play and then everyone will know. I mean maybe I could wear like a pin. Like or like a name tag. I could just wear like rainbows all the time. Like everything. Rainbow. Rainbow shirt, rainbow pants, rainbow shoes, rainbow socks, rainbow gloves, rainbow scarf, rainbow headband, rainbow hair, rainbow eyeshadow, rainbow mascara, rainbow fingernail polish, rainbow... I think I ran out of ideas. Rainbow face paint. 